Good evening, this is David Finkley in Washington, where the big debate is about to begin. Mr. President, how would you describe Capitol Hill? Mr. Carter, if you were elected, what would you order Congress to do? Shake, shake, shake. Ah, this is Lieutenant Colombo assigned to security. Mr. President, I'm sorry to bother you. After your nomination, what did Mr. Reagan whisper to you? This has got to be the saddest day of my life. And what was your reply? Let's just kiss and say goodbye. Ah, oh, Mr. President, this is Edith Bunker. Yeah. Tell me, what advice did Mrs. Ford give Nancy Reagan? when he wasn't selected as vice president. Oh, 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 yeah, Mr. Carter, I'm the spokesman for the youth vote, yeah. <laughs> we want to know what you mean by blanket pardons. Open the door. Let him in. Jimmy, this is Geraldine. Woo! Listen here, honey. What you think the black vote wants you to do? Well, I'm talking music, white boy. Oh, Mr. President, this is your favorite Hollywood square. <laughs> How do you feel about your opponent's economic policy? Some people want to build a world with silly love songs. Mr. Carter, this is the Godfather. I want to know what your solution is to the domestic problem. Gonna find my baby, gonna hold Grab some afternoon delight. Oh, Mr. Carter, I forgot to ask you, how does your mother feel about you? Heaven must be missing an angel. Before we bring this big debate to a close, President Ford, what would you like to say to your opponent? Don't go breaking my heart. And you, Mr. Carter? I won't go breaking your heart. Fine, fellas. Good night from Washington. Fellas. The debate's over, fellas. Fellas, please. It's up to the voters now. Fellas, it's over. Uh, this is David Finkley. The big debate.